Hi, everybody. Uh, we're back. And so remember, now what we're trying to do in the A count, the one thing that's, uh, one of the things that differentiates you from a beginning dancer is uh, the dimension that we add is circular. Okay, most of the things we're doing are going to be circular, and that adds an advanced dancer dimension to it. If we're linear and just doing that, which is real nice, but you can only go so far. Once you start going around a circle, then the real action happens, and a lot of creative things happen while you're dancing. So, uh, if you remember, we're into our circle, okay? So this time, we have our one, two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, we're going to do uh, the follows inside spin, okay? So when she, she comes here, we're gonna have one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight, okay? Now, uh, leader, okay, leads, you're doing the same things you did before with a circle. One, two, three, and four, behind, behind, step, step, okay? Now, the follower, this time, is doing a spin on her second step, on her rock step. So she's gonna go rock, spin, okay? And most of it's gonna be done there. So we're not waiting until the three and four this time. So we're gonna go and, rock, spin, three and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, now, to do that, uh, leads, you have to lead, okay? So you know you're gonna take her into spin, she doesn't. So you have to prep her, because she can't do a spin from just standing, she has to be prepped. So what I do is give a little push with my left hand and turn her out, okay? Let me take it from the back here so you can see it. So I push her out with my left hand, and then with my right hand, I turn her in. So push with the left, push with the right, okay? So hand is doing this and this, this and this. See how it just flips around, turns her in. Now while I'm flipping her in, one, two, I'm also bringing this, my left hand across her front to turn her. And remember that helps her because one of the uh, principles or techniques that she uses to turn is to bring her elbow across her center and that helps her turn. Okay, so we do that for her. We go one across, right. And you wanna bring it all the way across and uh, follows, let him do that, one. Let him bring this arm all the way across because remember that elbow will help pull you around. Now if you're doing a free spin, you can just put it straight across. But if you're going under, you just do it like that. So it's a little bit of an angle, but it's still operative, okay? So we'll go one spin, three and pull, step, step, triple step. One spin, three and in, step, step, triple step. One spin, three and four, five, six, seven and eight. And then just keep going around, okay? So there you go, you have the, uh, the follows uh, inside turn.